Hello Navigator, in this video we will be talking about the flooding damper that is installed in the pump room. The upper one, this is the latest type, which is hydraulically driven. And the other one, this one is the conventional type. The use of this kind of damper is basically for ventilation purposes. So without wasting time, let's get into the details of this flooding damper that is uh, situated in pump room most commonly in tanker ship you will find the pump room so let's consider this is a pump room this is the mechanical ventilation down part is open to provide the air from the below part of the pump room so this is how the ventilation is ensured now in case of flooding that means when this part will be full of water how the ventilation can continue or how the ventilation can maintain so that people still can go inside and do the necessary required job to facilitate this operation the uh, the concept of this flooding damper came into existence the flooding damper is basically you will find somewhere here there is a, another opening here which is controlled by a arrangement of closing device so it can be closed and it can be open as well now question is when to keep close we can keep close when the normal operation is there when we need the air from the below part and when to keep open during the flooding or in case of flooding if the round part is flooded let's say up to this part is already uh, drawn by the water then we can still continue ventilation using the flap so there is a connection from the flap side till the outside of the pump room so that from the outside can be controlled it can be open and it can be closed so if you can open from outside then the ventilation can go through here and can continue ventilate the space inside the pump room so that is the basic purpose and now i am going to read about this from the intertanko guidelines regarding the flooding damper it says are officers aware of the correct setting of pump room fire and flooding dampers and are the dampers clearly marked and in good order if we read further the purpose of flooding dampers is not always fully understood the extraction fan suction intakes are fitted at the low, lower most levels of the pump room flooding dampers must be kept in the closed position other than when their operation is being tested keeping flooding dampers open will not aid ventilation the dampers and their open close position should be clearly marked so we understand from the above reading that uh, the flooding damper that is situated here should be kept closed during the normal condition of the pump room so that the ventilation takes place properly from the down part but in case of flooding we should keep this flap open using the remote control system so that the ventilation can be still continue when the flooding takes place to ensure the safe environment inside the pump room keeping flooding dampers open will not aid ventilation it means if we keep the flap open during the normal condition the ventilation will not be proper the dampers and their open close position should be marked clearly marked so it is a requirement that uh, open and close position should be clearly marked so this is marking we can see the whole purpose of this flooding damper is to ensure ventilation even in case of flooding there must be clearly marking of to be kept closed except in case of flooded bilge that means there should be a poster or a clearly marked by the stencil that to be kept closed except in case of flooded bills it can be near to the uh, remote lever of the flooding damper outside the pump room if we talk about the maintenance and record keeping of this uh, flooding damper testing of damper operating arrangement both local and remote as per pms to be maintained so following the company procedure to be maintained and record keeping should be there now let's talk about what is the remedy when the flooding takes place every pump room is fitted with minimum two bilge suction valves to overcome from such flooding situations 
So we understand from this that there are fixed bilge pumps are there during the flooding situation to assist to take out all the flooded water from below the pump room. You can watch my another videos regarding this and I hope this video is uh, found helpful for you. So thank you so much for watching this video and I hope to meet you in next video.